Welcome back to another Trash to Treasure. So today I definitely found some trash. Let me show it to you. All right, so this first piece, after I bought it, I showed it to my husband and he looked at me and said, you actually paid money for that? This is it. To be honest, I think I actually splurged a little bit because it was $3.50. I think this could have definitely been like a buck, 50 cents, but totally worth it because we have a huge dog and he eats a ton of food. And I wanted to get one of those really cute farmhouse canisters to keep his food in so it'd stay fresh, but they are $72. Like everywhere I look, $70. So for $3.50, I am going to make the same thing as the $72 version I saw on Amazon. Here's the thing. I didn't realize this until my daughter ripped it open when we got home. It's full of stuffing. I'm pretty scared of what is gonna be at the bottom of it. I feel like it might be full of mouse turds. So let's just open it and find out. Oh my God, this time? Okay. Best case scenario, this belonged to a sewer. Worst case scenario, there's like legit a rodent nest in here. So we can find out together. This one here. Worst thing I found was a dead earwig bug. Not bad. That just needs to be wiped down. It'll be good. Okay, that was not bad. It's fine. But this happened to me once. I bought an old typewriter that I was so excited about and it honestly had a mouse nest in it. I couldn't clean it out. It's still in our garage because I don't know what to do with it. All right, so here's the other thing. This I think was probably very cute and stylish in its day but could definitely use a little update. So I have a fun plan to make this more modern farmhouse. All right, so first things first, this is getting cleaned and then we'll just take it outside and give it a fresh coat of white spray paint. Now that's all finished, I'm gonna take it outside for a quick coat of spray paint. I was so excited to find these small cans of spray paint called Krylon Shortcuts for the lid. So now I won't have a whole can of half-used spray paint sitting around. So this is the $70 canister that I saw on Amazon that I wanna to try to replicate with my $3 Goodwill canister. So I'm gonna hop onto my silhouette over here and print out something like this. All right, so I'll print that out and put it on the side of the canister. I'm painting over the red frame to give it a whitewashed barnwood type look and then just painting the inside white. While that dries, time to finish up the dog food canister. All right, the spray paint is all dry. So now, this is the dog food label that I printed out and I am just gonna put it right there and be done. So for $3.50 versus $70, we have a cute little place to store all of the dog's food. Now to finish up our other project. So this frame is already transformed. I painted the inside white and then just did a weathered wood type frame. And now I printed out the word stay a while. I think that's such a cute little saying to put right in the middle. And that's it, all finished. I think it turned out great. 
Thank you so much for stopping by and watching these Trash to Treasure projects. I hope you enjoyed them. If you did, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you again soon. Have a great day. Bye.